guys, this is my, what I call my super sneaky smooth stripe method. And it is a way of carrying the yarn in the front so that it is practically jogless. You can just barely see right here that there's an extra little edge of the V. And that's where you're, we're carrying the yarn and it makes it invisible and blend in really well. And then also it is reversible and there is no floats on the back. It's just just looks normal. I came up with this method when I made my inside out upside down cowl pattern because you can see right here this is right there there's that extra stitch right there and that is where I joined all those stripes and then on the back side perfectly smooth so let me show you how to do that We are going to start our purple stripe here. So the white yarn is going to come into the front and then it is going to come over here and the purple yarn is going to come from the bottom and then up over the white. And that that's pretty much it. It's pretty much the technique there. I'm just gonna snug that up a little bit and then we're gonna start knitting our stripe here. you can see that right right there is our little purple I think that's it yeah that's it that's our little purple twist right there and then this one will come up for the next row so let me knit a row and I will show you that again Okay, we are back around to the beginning of the row, and my yarn is a little tangled. It does get a little messy here. Okay, so we have the white yarn waiting right here for us. Just finished up with the purple that is coming to the front, and it is going to come this way, and then the white yarn is going to come up over that purple into the back so we can start knitting our next row. I haven't tried this method on anything other than just one row stripes, so I don't know if it would work, but I will let you know once I try it. And there it is. There's those super sneaky smooth stripes.